Hello guys, welcome back and if you are new to my YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button to get the latest update of my videos. What I'm going to do for today is uh, I'm going to make four kinds of shapes. I have a diamond, I have a rectangle, I have a heart, and I have a circle. So these are the four shapes that I'm going to do with my t-shirt tie-dye for today. Alright, let's go! I'm going to make a heart shape and I'm going to use brilliant red for this one for the whole shirt I'm going to use a uh, Crayola for my markings and don't worry this uh, marker is uh, washable So let's go start. So first I have to reverse this shirt So in this one, I'm going to make a heart shape for this and I'm gonna mark it Yeah, then we're gonna follow this line all throughout here Then we're gonna follow this. So that's it. And I only made three shapes for this one. And for the rest of these, I'm going to crumple this. So this is it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and let's color this with red. I hope this one will make a heart shape. So actually guys, I add more water for this one so it won't be very dark red. The outcome will be pastel colors. I hope it will turn out hard. I think my shirt is a little bit uh, wet so find out so that's it for now so for our next t-shirt I'm going to make a rectangle shape and the color for this one is blue All right seems like this one is kind of hard So this is our blue triangle tie-dye t-shirt. So our third shirt for today is a circle and I'm going to use a green dye. This is our circle tie-dye green t-shirt. For our fourth shirt, I'm going to make a diamond. Well, next time, I'm gonna make a bigger uh, shape so that it's not hard to follow the lines. going to use violet tie-dye so this is it my violet uh, diamond tie-dye right so all right guys I already have here my four colored shape tie-dye t-shirt and I'm not confident enough what will be the outcome of the shape because um, the shape that I made is too small so I hope after 24 hours everything will go smooth but on this one here on my first color I am not really confident to have a, ha a heart shape for this one because um, my shirt is too wet all right guys I'm gonna put this in the ziplock and uh, we'll see all right these are my four colored uh, tie-dye t-shirt they're already in the ziplock and we'll wait for 24 hours and then we're gonna rinse it all right see you tomorrow guys 
Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and after 24 hours, I already have here my tie-dye project. It's been sealed for 24 hours. So here it is guys. So what we're gonna do for today is we're gonna rinse it and then we're gonna wash it on a washing machine and um, I'm gonna show you my finished product once I'm done. So I'm gonna rinse the red one. This one is I am not confident enough because when I dye this one, the t-shirt was really wet. So I don't know if there is a hard shape on this one, but I think this one is a failed. Where is my heart here? See that? Where's the heart? It turned out to be circle. Oh my god, but anyway, there's still, um, the design is still there. So far, it's uh, kind of pastel colors. So, the next one is the blue. So, we'll see. I forgot what shape is this one. So it seems like this one is a circle. <laughs> Everything is a circle. See? So probably this blue is the circle one. So the next one is the green. And this is my favorite color. Hopefully this one is what do I have here? <laughs> I think guys this is a diamond and seems like a circle again. <laughs> I can see the diamond in here but anyway so far I still love them. I didn't get the um, the exact shape is because of the the shape that I made is too small. Lesson learned. Next time I'm gonna make it a bigger one. The last one is the purple. So I think the purple is... <laughs> oh no, I think the purple is diamond. So the purple is diamond. It seems like there's a diamond shape in there. Can you see it? See? So anyway, let's rinse this and find out later. So here we go guys, let's wash this in the washing machine and we'll see the outcome. Alright, so guys I'm going to wash this shirt together but this is just like an experiment. I'm gonna try it if they will stain to one another. Actually I already rinsed this one and I'm going to try if they're gonna stain with each other. But guys, this is just like an experiment. I'm gonna try this if it works then you can do it but if it doesn't don't actually this is not an advisable but this one is just like an experiment don't do it okay guys all right guys i've done washing the shirt so in the process of drying this shirt uh they said that you have to let it dry high in the shirt but this time i'm going to dry this shirt inside the dryer so we'll see so all right guys i'm done drying my shirt oh see this i love the pastel colors that i made oh yeah see that oh, all right guys here is my finished product and so far i love it i think this one is a diamond shape yeah i think this one is a diamond but it didn't turn out like a diamond but overall i love the pastel color of green and um, i don't see any uh, stain from the other colors and and the other one is uh, the blue one, the pastel color blue. Yeah, I think this one is, a, I guess, a circle <laughs> because the shape that I made is a circle. And same with the green, there's no stain on it and uh, I love it. <laughs> I love the color. And then the other one is the red one. It turned out light pink. And I think this one is a heart shape. I don't know if you can find a heart in here, but seems like a circle again. So anyway, no stain, looks good, and uh, it's fine with me. The next one is the, the purple. I think this one is the diamond. See this? See this one? 
Yeah, I think this one is a diamond. And same with the three colors, no stain. And I love the pastel color, light purple. And so far, everything looks good to me. All right, guys, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy watching my video for this film four kinds of shape but it turned out pretty cool and I love the way the pastel colors came out and it turned out uh, super light colors and it's very pleasing in the eyes all right guys probably next time if I'm going to make uh, a shape I'd rather make a bigger size so that it's not hard for me to follow the lines and make that shape lesson is make a bigger shape and uh, with regard to the uh, washing of the different colors so far it's good they don't stay with each other and dry up from the dryer it's uh, good too so if you want to do the process I did you can do it but of course you have to take the consequence of the result alright guys and uh, after watching this video don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button to get the latest update of my videos bye